Hello, this is Excalibur Zero here for Mind Test Mod Showcase. Today I will be showing you the Nuke Mod. Nuke Mod is um, created by S Fan, and as you can see here is its forum page. I'll post a link to it in the video description. This mod adds um, four different types of TNT to Mind Test, which um, simply explode when you activate them. Um, crafting recipes, there's um, Iron TNT, um, Messy TNT, which that appears not to be, I'm not sure that's, I don't think that's the correct image, but it looks kind of like that. And then there's Hardcore Iron TNT, Hardcore and Messy TNT. Um, the Iron TNT and the Messy TNT um, are just simple explosions, they just explode at a set radius. But the hardcore versions of them send out multiple of the normal versions of them, and then those all explode and scatter all over the place and create a whole bunch of different blast radiuses. They just jump from different points and all that. Which offers more if you want to like blow up a cave rather than if you want to blow up a civic, civic um, shape. Well, a sphere, actually. Um, so now I'll get to showing you that. Okay, let me just set the time so you can see a little bit better. And let's take a look now. Find a good spot. Okay, I think about here should be good. So, as you can see in my inventory, I have Iron TNT, Messy TNT, Hardcore Iron TNT, and Hardcore and Messy TNT. So, um, essentially how they work is you place them like any other node with a right click and then um, you punch them to activate them. They'll start flashing and eventually they will explode like that. They destroy all the nodes in the radius around them they don't drop any of the nodes or anything like that, and um, that's the blade, the blast radius of the small TNT. I'll uh, show you um, that a little bit easier to see. Um, so it's not, when you do it underground, you can really see the blast radius. And, um, uh, it's not working so easy. Pretty much like this, it's um, kind of like an outward cubish sphere thing. Um, but it's so it's not that big. It's only a few nodes in diameter. With the iron TNT, however, there's also the messy TNT, which has a much larger blast radius. I'll try that out. And I'll get it. This has a much larger blast radius. Um, yeah, you can see there. <laughs> much larger. Then you have the hardcore iron and messy TNTs. So I'll show you those. That's the hardcore iron. And as you can see, it shoots out a whole bunch of the TNTs, which fall to the lower, fall to the first node, um, and like sand, and then they all explode, which creates much more um, organic, I guess, looking um, explosions. If you want to like um, dig out a cave or something, and you use regular iron TNT, um, it'll look really kind of cubey and all that. But if you use hardcore TNT, it blows um, holds faster and it does them in a more kind of interesting way rather than having everything be really geometrical. And then last but not least is the hardcore messy TNT which should have I haven't used, actually used it before but as I can assume it has a very large blast radius. <laughs> Let's try it out. So it's, it's gonna have do the same thing as Hardcore Iron TNT, but with Messy TNT, so it should be very much bigger. 
And I believe um, once there's multiple of the TNTs out, once one goes off, um, and there's another one that's not going off, it sends it scattering. So it has a higher blast radius. Can't see. Yep. You see them just scattering like that. And that way they send out a lot more. Um, they destroy nodes in more of a kind of outwards fashion. You can see there's a little bit of delay, I think, here, just because it's such a big space and doesn't um, fully load all the blocks and all that, all the sectors. Um, so I'll show you um, um, scattering of regular TNTs, just not horde car, but um, just regular TNT that scatters as well, I believe. If I were to set off a few set up only one and have a few nearby um, it will scatter the other ones around and set them off as well I think yeah see and then those go off as well So all in all, it's uh, quite an interesting mod. Um, I like to use it sometimes for mining. You do have to use up some iron to be able to make even the iron TNT. But um, especially with the uh, hardcore iron, it's really good for mining because you can blast out a uh, entire small cave area and then grab all the um, ores you can find. Um, and the cost of the if you're doing crafting. Um, cost of the hardcore versus the regular tends to not be that much since um, regular is the base recipe and then you use the regular one in the hardcore recipe and you only have to use um, four things of coal to get to the hardcore which gives it a much larger blast radius um, and this mod is pretty interesting for um, creative games as well you can um, use it to I've used um, just iron TNT to um, build out tunnels and um, caves as well, uh, um, like mining shafts or any kind of shaft into a um, underground area. Used it. Uh, used messy TNT once to make uh, a um, room to store a nuclear generator in from the Tectic mod. And those are pretty large. Well, the whole setup on is pretty large, and Messy TNT lets you e easily get a nice geometric cave that you can put it in. And that's about it. This mod is pretty sim it's fairly simple, but it's nice and interesting. I highly recommend it. And that's about all. I'm going to include the, the forum topic link in the video description and if you have any other questions just let me know. This is Excalibur Zero signing off.